Well, I think my first connection to the river was um, passing across it. I lived uh, close to the university when I first came in 1967, and um, I didn't, as I was up close to the hill, um, I didn't have much opportunity to cross the river. So when I did, it was a significant adventure. Um, and I loved the fact that our town was uh, defined by a river. I lived fairly close to the hill, so the river was not in my perspective, but I made many opportunities to go down to the river, to see what was happening on the river, uh, to see who was living on the river. Probably the most memorable experience I had on the river in that first year I was here was I had people visiting me from other parts of the country and I had to take them to the river and this was the summertime so we all decided to go in swimming and the water at that time uh, I stepped into the river off the bank was just up to my up to my calf and so I walked across the river amazing just amazing it was so shallow and uh, there were these other people who were with me so we all sort of little gang of us walked across the river yeah I've never seen the river that shallow in that first year I was here and I guess I would just say about the river is that um, I have friends I continue to live close to the university but I have friends who live in um, on both sides of, of the river and so I cross the river frequently to visit people and I know that in the past before I came to Lawrence the river flooded and really was uh, pretty frightening to live in proximity to the river but I have never had anything but the kindest thoughts toward the Kansas River because it's it's uh, it's just a wonderful demarcation not only do I orient myself to the river when I'm in the town, if you're downtown, you think, ah, oh, the river's that way. So, and I wanna go this way in the town. I think that Lawrence is largely defined by the existence of the river. Certainly, the town wouldn't be here were it not for the river. So I have great gratitude to the Kansas River. I hope that the river will continue to be cared for um, by anybody who lives in any proximity to it. Friends of the Caw have a special interest in caring for the river, but I think everybody in the town should visit the river, should walk along the river, should realize that the river was here first, realize that Native people settled on the river before we white folks came along and uh, began to have our mills and our, whether they're paper mills or grist mills or whatever they are, to use the river productively. But I think the river was a geographically a defining point for the first humans who settled here. The river was also, before humans were here, there were surely animals of every sort who, who drank river water and there were fish that lived in the river. And the, river the river has just been, a, I think, a source of life for our community for centuries beyond centuries. I like to think that we have a river of stars overhead and a river of water on our ground.